We are back and turning to Kern County election results now. Ballots have been streaming in and the count is underway. 17's Connor Door joining us live from inside the elections office with what is happening there and uh, what's next for all of those ballots to count. Good evening, Connor. Tammy, good evening. Yeah, we're here live from inside the elections office. The last voter has just left and walked out of the building. The voter precincts are dropping off their ballots, and I'm here live with Amy Espinoza, Kearns Registrar of Voters. Amy, how are you doing? How does it feel, you know, to kind of have this day wind down a little bit? Um, great. So it's a busy day, as I mentioned earlier. Um, really busy. We've seen things um, that, you know, in March we um, had some questions and stuff due to redistricting, so we saw some of those same kind of questions. We had voters coming out for the first time this year, so to be expected, um, but poll sites were really busy, just like downtown. Um, we send out a lot of extra paper, a lot of extra supplies um, to keep the poll sites running, but um, I just got word that Ridgecrest is about to come in, so um, that's our last site, so in about two hours We'll have all of our poll sites in. Perfect. When are you going to start processing these ballots? When is the soonest? Um, so they're processing right now all of the poll place ballots right behind me. Um, all of these will be processed tonight before we go home. And then vote by mail will start back up again, hopefully tomorrow afternoon. If not tomorrow afternoon, then Thursday morning. Awesome. And we all saw that big line outside of the elections office today. It was almost a two-hour wait. Is there something that maybe in the next coming election that the elections office could do to kind of shorten that wait time? I know a lot of voters were upset, you know, about that wait time. Yeah, so we have four election um, windows here here and then we actually close down county clerk on election day and we have another four windows that we serve voters um, recommendation to voters is either go to their poll sites in the future or if they come in earlier we've been open since october 7th um, and haven't seen nearly the amount of traffic that we saw today and yesterday so just um you know planning a little planning to come in a little more uh before election day and to miss some of those lines Perfect. And then, you know, with the integrity of this election, anything people that are questioning, we have observers here, um, anything, you know, you want to say to those uh, people? Um, just that we take our job very seriously. Um, we do have observers and everyone has the right to observe. Um, we have live streaming of our processes. Folks can go on our website right now, kernvote.com, and we have our processing areas live streamed. So folks can just see kind of everything moving through those areas. Um, and then when we're processing ballots, those are live streamed as well. And um, again, everyone's welcome to come in. We have reconciliations along the way. We have dedicated staff. We have just a lot of security measures. Perfect, Amy. Thank you so much. All right, guys. That's it from us here at the elections office. Back to you in studio.